third car and the fourth car. Don't be shy and just go on your train. All right, people, what's going on? No, it's not. Ixnay on the eyeballs. They're chocolate candy anyway. <laughs> hey, what's up, people? Welcome aboard the Terra Tramp. I just thought I'd just uh, kind of eyeball the situation. <laughs> I'll just stick to eating the candy, though. All right, my name is Yvette, your favorite sister ghoul friend. <laughs> That's Jeff, our driver. Give him a nice round of applause, please. Thank you. Now shut up. All right, warning, warning, warning. This portion of your experience here at Universal can be a little edgy. This way, come on up. Consider come yourself on down. warned. And you don't need to run, we don't want anybody. This is the look, and this is me off it. <laughs> We're gonna get this show rolling in just a few moments, so stay tuned. All right, we're out of here. Wave goodbye to everybody. Wave goodbye. Did you wave goodbye? Did you wave goodbye? Because you're never going to see them again. <laughs> That's right. For the next few minutes, you all belong to me. Come here. Please, for your comfort and for your safety, we have a few rules. Please remain seated at all times. The tram is moving. In other words, keep your butts in your seats. If you're standing up, I'm gonna tell you, drop it like it's hot. Also, keep your arms, your legs inside at all times. And if you have small children with you, what the hell were you thinking? This is an adult theme night. Anyway, people always ask us, why don't you guys take the tram out after dark? In my head, I'm like, oh. But there's a good reason for that. And tonight, you're going to find out why. For those of you who have been keeping up with current events, you may have heard about a little tip the studio was having with one of its directors. For those of you who didn't, well, let's bring you up to speed. In 2006, Universal Pictures announced the signing of Pavel Pronevsky to helm a new horror movie for the studio that invented the genre. Pavel had already made a name for himself in his native country of Slovakia with his controversial film, The Widow's Eye. Despite rumors of Pavel's unethical filmmaking techniques, production began on the Universal lot on June 6, 2006. A publicity film crew was dispatched to capture the moment. Nothing compares to real blood on film. It's really the only way to capture the emotion, the fear, the reality, and what the victim is feeling. All three members of the crew disappeared immediately after this interview. A week later, the first daily started coming in from the set of Pavel's production. The studio was horrified at what they saw. The production was shut down, the footage locked up in the vault, and Pavel's contract with Universal was terminated. But security was unable to locate the director. 
he was thought to have returned to his native Slovakia until employees started reporting a strange looking man apparently living on the Universal backlot. Soon the internet was flooded with sightings of the mysterious director. Uh, we got Norman right there. <laughs> A few weeks later, this tape arrived at Universal Pictures, addressed to the head of production. It's a shame you did not share my vision, but I cannot let you kill my masterpiece. It must continue, and it will. I don't need your money, I don't need your crew, your brainy actors. What I'm interested in is reality. These people are that reality. They shall help me complete my masterpiece. They live their dull little lives and come here hoping to touch Hollywood. And now Hollywood shall touch them. Dang! That dude is crazy! Ooh. Ooh. They say Pavel is still out there somewhere. Trying to make that movie. But I guess you're gonna have to find that out for yourself. Because ahead is where we stop. That's as far as me and Jeff are going to go. And you, you're gonna have to get out and walk. You heard me! You're gonna have to get off the tram! So get to stepping! Move it! Get out! Go! You two! Step up, Grandpa! They say your tablet is looking for the
We've got a tram coming up the hill, so please look down at your feet. Make sure you're standing on a yellow dot. A yellow dot represents seat on the tram. Also, for those of you on the front of the line, please make sure you're standing behind that yellow line. 
for your safety so we can get this tram in here and get you guys on board very quick. <laughs> behind that yellow line. That way we can get you guys uh, safely on board once this tram comes to a stop. on myspace.com I'm in his top 16 <laughs> <laughs> I am go find me right there Justine <laughs> I crack myself up <laughs> you know you're all gonna add him when you get home right send a little message Pavel I just loved your movie will you be my friend Add me back, please. <laughs> so who's going to a Halloween party afterwards? Anybody? Any parties today? Yeah? I'm going to one. All the tour guides party after Halloween more nights. We all do. Party to Pavel. His crew. Or oh, actually, he doesn't have any crew. Never mind. I am his assistant and girlfriend, so kind of got to help him out there. Yeah. <laughs> 
See that? I already started. Damn, I already missed it. Bummer. <laughs> you know all the show times? 11:45. Where? Where does it say that? I'm so proud of you. You know all the show times, and I don't. <laughs> Did you guys go on the mummy ride in Jurassic Park? Those are all open. Yeah? You see Chucky? Did he insult all of you? I hear he insults everybody. I kind of want to go see him. Who's scared of chainsaws? They scare the crap out of me out there. I don't like them. I know they're fake. I know they're not going to touch me, but they still scare me. They still do. So, Tiny, what are we waiting on here? One more gate. Hmm. So is everybody ready for Halloween? I am. Does anybody go to West Hollywood on Santa Monica Boulevard? That is one crazy ass party. Walking through the streets, it's one big parade. It goes on all night. It's pretty fun. Yes, drinking, lots of good music, good clubs. I would highly recommend going and doing that for Halloween. You'll find it is the best time ever. Guys, for those of you All right. Let's get this show on the road. Welcome back. That is me, the person that has been talking to you this entire time. What a dork, I know. Hi. My name is Justine. Our driver's name is Tiny. Also known as John. John, let's give John a round of applause. Well, five. There we go. All right. I see that most of you have made it back. Some of you at least. And uh, no worries. If you lost any friends or loved ones back there, you can... Uh, pick them up or what's left of them at guest relations and if you lost any personal items such as arms, legs, children, <laughs> we'll mail them back to you free of charge. Thanks Universal. Anyways, we're going to be bringing you back into the park shortly so you can enjoy the rest of uh, Halloween Horror Nights. Uh, John, John's on the phone right now. What's up, John? The, the road's closed? The road's closed. We, we can't go that way. Uh-oh. Um, folks, <laughs> John, John just said the road's closed, so we're going to have to take a little uh, detour here. So bear with us. Uh, up ahead are some old movie sets, old movie sets from Stephen Summers' The Mummy. We normally don't take the tram down this way at night, or even during the day. Um, but there's a first time for everything, so... Uh, um, hold on a second, guys. Uh, these, these sets are being used right now. What the hell's going on here? Uh, I, I don't know what's going on. Uh, we need to call security. Uh, John, get on that right now. I, I don't know the number, but we're we're gonna go in here. Uh oh. Okay, Pavel told me he wasn't gonna be filming anymore. He said that that was it for the night. Oh, okay, folks, just hang on, hang on. Uh, we're we're gonna get you out of here, but as soon as I don't know. You call me sick. I'm your girlfriend. You can call me sick. They can only be cleansed and quiet. Oh, oh, oh. 
Yes. You want the vision? Maybe you just need to see things from the Although I was only trying to help. Let's see if I can find you a I'll talk to him later about that, but what can you do? He's just another one of the Mad Men maniacs that have been a part of Universal since the studio was founded over 90 years ago. <laughs> I love Tales from the Crypt. you log on to HalloweenHorrorNights.com Not MySpace.com, we already talked about that. HalloweenHorrorNights.com where you can vote for your favorite Scream Queen on behalf of John R. Driver. Let's give John a round of applause! Once again, for getting us through that dark, dark back lot. And myself, Justine, I wish you a happy, happy Halloween. Please be safe and enjoy the rest of your night here at Halloween Horror Nights. We'll see you in the movies. Take care, everybody! Woohoo! Thanks, John. I get off my train. You guys are awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You survived Justine's scary train. Liza. We might all have a drink later. We'll never know. Hi, everybody. Oh, let me see that drink. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. The green. Let me see that cup. Let me see. I just want to see it. Oh, that's awesome. I gotta get one. <laughs> 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 when I get back to the hotel, I can't wait to go to the hotel.